Hi folks, welcome to the Money Mental UK YouTube channel. I'm your host Andrew, I'm a part-time eBay and Depop reseller. And today I am recording a charity shop haul. It's Sunday the 11th of June, July, July. It's, it's the European Championships or Euros final day. Uh, England are in the final, come on England. Hopefully by the time this video comes out we'll have secured a glorious victory or will have been absolutely stuffed um but yeah i thought i would uh, do a pre-record for this charity shop haul um i've actually listed everything that's in it uh, so i picked up the stuff today and i've listed it there's like 13 items in total so uh not too many but yeah i've spent grand total of just over 25 quid and got a few items that hopefully uh, should make me some good money so I'll just pull them out no particular uh, order to show you what I've got uh, first item a pair of Dickies cargo trousers Dickies very popular brand on especially on Depop at the minute these were £3.50 uh, size 36 legs 30 so for a shorter person than me uh, otherwise if they were 34 I'd probably keep them um, yeah, they were three pound fifty to pay for those, and I've listed those for twenty two ninety five. All my prices include shipping as well. Uh, in the same charity shop, I picked up this really cool Star Trek USS Enterprise NCC seventeen oh one t shirt. It is official CBS merchandise, done by on a Gildan tag. It's only from two thousand and thirteen, so it's not particularly vintage or anything. But I just thought it was so cool. There's nothing like this on eBay at the minute cost two pound i've listed it for 14.95 free shipping uh, and i'll probably put it on depop for 15 quid at some point as well uh this this is a really good brand uh which is pink thomas pink of german street it's a czech uh like uh, flannel shirt which we've not seen them do before it said it was a medium on the charity shop tag it's actually a size small um i don't normally pick up size small stuff but I picked this up anyway, it's £2.95. I have listed it for £17.95 free shipping because there wasn't really anything to compare that to on eBay. Um, different charity shop. I picked up these Abercrombie shorts, paid £2. Listed them for £19.95 free shipping. If they were cargo shorts, you know, pockets of stuff on, they'd go for slightly more, but £2 into 20 I'm not going to complain. Uh, also same charity shop I picked up this brand new with tags weird fish short sleeve shirt again only a size small but because it's brand new decent brand two quid perfect for the summer um, yeah picked it up listed that for 21 95 it's probably pushing it probably should have gone for 19 95 but we'll give it a try uh, then I picked up some skirt things uh, I'm not very good with skirts but this is uh, by Oops, camera's dropped. Doesn't help when you've got your stock just behind the uh, camera. Um, it does knock it. This was Jigsaw, um, which is a good brand to look out for. This was £2. Wool skirt thing, don't really know anything about it, but listed it for £19.95 anyway. Because I am trying out ladies' clothing. I uh, also picked up this David Barry, which is not really a great brand, but it's David Barry coat. It was £2. It's a wool and cashmere blend, and only 5% cashmere. So, because of cashmere in it, I paid two quid for it. I've sold a similar one to that for either 20 or 25 before. It's not really the right season to list something like that in, but I've put it on for 19.95 anyway, just so it's listed. It'll probably hang about for a bit. And then again, some train skirt things. This ladies' Mark Suspenser's denim skirt, size 12, cost two quid. Um, listed it for 11.95 free shipping because basically that's what a similar one's gone for um gotta stop knocking that camera boy also two pounds was this full zip g star raw zipper uh zipper sweater sweatshirt um yeah g star does do quite well for me on ebay i've actually listed that for 29.95 because the same one in a slightly different color Went for 29.95 i think that's probably a bit high probably go closer to the 20 pound mark but start off high can always lower the prices um see what happens 
Well, I picked up a blazer. I've been staying away from blazers because that they used to sell quite well for me. They're not selling that well at the minute because you know people are working from home, etc. Not going out as much with the apocalypse. But I picked this up because it's two pounds. It is Marks and Spencer's. I can't say this, but Colizioni. But I picked it up because it's silk and linen, linen blend. It's like 55% silk, 45% linen, or the other way around. I can't remember which. So that's really good materials. I've had the same blazer before, the exact same one that I've sold for 30 quid. Um, but that was before the apocalypse. So I've listed that again for 29.95. But I think that'll probably go closer to 20 when it sells. Uh, another skirt thing. I mean, this used to be a good brand, but I don't think it is anymore. Um, Jacques Vert, French. It's only a polyester skirt anyway. But it was a pound. I'm trying them out. I've listed it for 9.95, but I think that's a little high. I think I've gone for about seven or eight quid at the minute, so probably should have left that one. Uh, ooh, I think that's nearly it actually. Um, Emma was giving me grief for only picking up clothes because I was messaging her showing what I was picking up. So I picked up a Disney mug. Uh, Disneyland Paris, SO commercial promotional product thing with pound. I've listed it for 9 95 free shipping. There are some listed for slightly more, but they haven't sold. So I thought I'll just go in slightly lower. Pound into £10, pound, be all right with that. Probably go for about eight or nine quid when it sells. Uh, this was a really good find. This is a Twilight uh, Eclipse um, T-shirt on a Gildan tag. Uh, paid two pound for it. Pretty sure everyone would have ignored that, but I did some research and somebody's got twenty four ninety five plus shipping for one of those. Uh, that wasn't in as good condition as this one. This one looks hardly warm, so I have listed that for twenty nine ninety five free shipping, and I expect it to go for around the twenty five mark. So, yeah pleased with that and that was everything total spent was let's have a look um I've got a spreadsheet because i'm you know cool like that now 26 pound 45 it's worked it out as and i've listed it all for a grand total of 259 pound 35 um so yeah say 25 quid into 250 um Obviously, some of that stuff will sell for a lower price. Some some might sell quickly, some might hang about for a bit. But I should be looking, even after shipping costs, eBay fees, etc., at making about 100 quid profit. So that's not bad from a couple of hours out on a Sunday afternoon, and a couple of hours listing it. You know, um, I've probably spent less than four hours' time to make hopefully about 100 quid, maybe slightly more. So, yeah, really pleased with that. Hopefully you've uh, enjoyed watching that. It'll be interesting to see how the skirt things get on if they um, sell well or not, because that is something new. I'm just trying to push myself a bit further into newer categories, and I think there's more people, more more ladies buying uh, secondhand clothing than there are men buying secondhand clothing. Um, from what I've seen on eBay, well, there's a lot more listed and a lot more sold anyway. So it is a category I'm trying to get into. I know that. You know you can get more returns etc on it um but it's something new to try out get myself out of my comfort zone anyway folks thanks for watching see you on the next video bye for now